Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. So Lauren and I did a thing, as you can see from the little snippet, trailer, whatever you want to call it. Uh, we built a fire pit in our backyard. Now, this was going to be a full-on do-it-yourself video. I'm missing some of the footage, some of the stuff I'm going to have to just walk you through. We built the fire pit around a 30-inch fire plate to determine the size we wanted. There are a lot of different places you can look for a fire plate. We bought ours on Amazon. We used 2x4s and 2x6s because we wanted the wood grain in our finished product. We ended up using eight of each type of board and a one by one to screw them together. At this point, you should have all your measurements and doesn't matter if you built the outside or inside first. We built the outside first because we wanted to see how it would sit on the concrete pad. We then built the inside box, making sure it was fairly precise. You don't want to have to make corrections to the concrete after it is set. We secured the box together with the leftover 2x6 boards. I also drilled a 1 inch hole that a PVC pipe was secured in for the valve access point. After it was all set, it was sprayed with WD-40 so it would separate from the concrete and we caulked all the cracks so it didn't leak out of the bottom. We couldn't get the concrete all the way up the backyard so we ended up taking a wheelbarrow and carting loads up. For the concrete we spent about $220 and that included cleaning out the mixer. The side blew out because I didn't have enough screws securing the boards. Don't do that. <laughs> we used straps to pull it back together, but it ended up with some variations in the concrete. We let the concrete set for about 28 hours and removed the forms and let it set another 48 hours before messing with it. We then added 40 pounds of fire rock, a mix of black and gold. And then if you want to stain the concrete, you've got to wait an entire month after it's done. So uh, just so you're aware, we haven't treated it, stained it, or anything like that other than patching it. I hope you guys like this project. Hopefully it helps you out in your own do-it-yourself projects. <laughs> 